College campuses across central Massachusetts recently received their annual Clary Act reports. The findings show schools in the area have seen an increase in the number of rape cases on campuses for the third consecutive year. Our Cam Janjar now joins us live with reaction. Cam? Anna, some local colleges even saw their number of reported cases double in the last year, but one expert says there may be a reason behind that. Colleges in central Massachusetts reported 34 cases of rape on their campuses in 2016. Area schools are required to keep and disclose campus crime statistics. While increasing numbers look concerning, student health advocates say it might also be a positive sign. Essentially what numbers going up means is that uh, universities are creating an environment where survivors feel more comfortable to come forward and get support and information. Marinelli Vasquez works with Assumption College for Pathways for Change, an organization providing services to those impacted by sexual violence. She says on a college campus, it's crucial for students to come out when they experience sexual misconduct. When people report essentially what that does is that it breaks the silence and it makes it more difficult for more people to get assaulted. Massachusetts Senator Michael Moore has filed a bill which aims to reduce barriers for victims to report sexual violence incidents. The bill would require all higher education facilities in the state to train its staff and students in prevention of sexual assault. These are like uh, small, small towns and they should be providing the services that we expect are going to protect our, protect our kids and provide them medical and the proper services. The 34 rape cases in 2016 is an increase from the 25 local colleges reported in 2015. College students say it's important to be prepared, but some tell us they're not concerned about sexual violence on campus. Does that make you nervous at all, seeing that those numbers are on the rise? I mean, um, personally, I don't think it does. Never try to be alone. Um, in general, like late at night, I'll always try to be with someone. I don't feel unsafe, maybe that's because of prior experience, um, and just generally something I don't feel concerned about um, personally. Now, Moore says the bill has gone through the Senate and it currently sits in the House. He says he hopes the amount of awareness that's been raised in the last year helps push the bill through. Anna? Thanks, Cam.